just wanted to take a look at this beautiful footage of the reopening of the spillway yesterday, the 14th of April. There go the there goes the water over the rock bolts. And great shot, DWR. You got it this time. You panned it out perfectly. We see the water plunging right into the plunge pool. Good shot. You can see how they've trimmed up around the edges of the canyon there to the left. Stair stepped it down. There's a little erosion. Now, this is the first hour of opening where they're cranking it up very quickly from zero to 35,000 CFS. But there you can see the erosion on the left side, the screen left side of the spillway. 915. Cranking it up quickly. Getting that water to fly further off the edge of the spillway and avoid further erosion. See him trimming up the, the cliff to the left. 9.30. I've really, <laughs> I've really grown fond of this natural, new natural made spillway. Look at that, it really works at this, at 35,000 CFS, it's really working well. Got you a rainbow in there. <laughs> 9.45, and by 10 a.m., they had it cranked right up to 35,000 CFS. And there we see the uh, water plume, the mist plume rising up, then the water pouring nicely over the bedrock, and we're knocking some more debris still back into the diversion pool there at the bottom. 10 a.m., full throttle for now, 35,000 CFS. They're going to let this run for up to a couple of weeks. The lake elevation peaked out at 866 feet when they opened this up, and it's today, Saturday, the 15th, very slowly coming down just around 865 feet and change. Remember, too, they've shut down the Hyatt power plant and will reopen it at only uh, half of the turbines working, so only 6,000 CFS as they do maintenance on the number one Penstock tunnel. Here's the data back at 9 a.m. on the 14th at 12.5 out of the Hyatt power plant and then quickly by 10 a.m. they had 35,000 coming out over the spillway with the Hyatt power plant shut down. Now look at these inflows though. We're just kind of matching the inflows uh, throughout the day during the heavier parts of the day at 35,000 CFS. That's why the reservoir is going to be very slow to come down and here we are right now this morning of the 15th saturday the 15th 8 a.m outflows at 35 inflows 30,000 cfs remember too today uh they're going to announce or the the winning contractor is going to be uh, awarded the contract today and with <laughs> the order to start work on monday i'm juan brown and you're watching the blanco lirio channel we're still on the road with the family heading to yosemite see you here